Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Molly and welcome to another exciting video. In this video, I will be talking about top 10 affordable makeup products which are absolutely worth your money. Now as Indian, I feel we are always gravitated towards affordable product, right? All the affordable products are not worth it, honestly, because some of the makeups are really, really worst when it comes to affordable makeup products. So that's why we save up money and then we purchase some expensive, luxurious makeup makeup right but today i am going to talk about 10 makeup products from primer to foundation to concealer every single thing in this video which actually worth your money which are affordable which might not rule the market but these will surely rule your heart so if you're interested to know what are the products that i'm going to recommend to you then please keep on watching the first product that i'm going to talk about is a primer of course it has to be a primer because i'm a primer freak and i think you cannot do your base without primer and i'm talking about ny bay primer this is a really tiny mini one as you guys can see the packaging but this will run up to six months if you are using at least twice or thrice a week because i don't feel you put on makeup every single day but even if you're using this in everyday purpose i think this will run for three months for sure but this one is a very beautiful silicone based primer it does not budge or crack on your face sometimes i feel some affordable primer feels really runny on the face and that completely moves your entire base makeup it blurs your pore i don't know about the hydrating one because it says it's a hydrating primer i didn't feel any hydration while applying this primer so I will just keep that part but this one says that blends like a dream lightweight formula minimizes pores and smoothens the skin and perfect base to a flawless look so all the points that I have mentioned are like they have broken down individually but basically this is a very beautiful silicone based primer so if you're looking for an affordable primer try the NY Bay one the next product has to be a foundation and this foundation can give tough competition to the high-end foundations as well and I'm talking about wet and wild photo focus foundation it does not give you any flashback it does not give you any patchiness and it just stays put throughout the day it just gives you a very beautiful satin matte finish not complete matte finish you can easily make a foundation matte finish by using some translucent powder or any compact powder but overall it gives you medium to full coverage as well and i just love this foundation trust me i have tried so many foundation under this budget like from lacme stay quirky faces canada but nothing can come close to this foundation i'm in the shade desert beige which is basically a medium dark foundation under golden undertone so if you are from nc36 to nc42 this one is the perfect shade for you although they don't have a lot of shade ranges but whatever they have they just serves the purpose overall the next product has to be a concealer and you would probably guess which concealer i'm going to recommend you Yes, you have guessed it right. Of course, it has to be Swiss Beauty Concealer. I have tried the pen concealer. I think this one is much better than the pen concealer. This is a full coverage concealer. You can use it to cover your darkness. You can use it as your eye base. Specifically, I use it as my eye base because it's not my shade, first of all. I have my shade, but mostly I use this as my base because I just love how eyeshadow glides on top of it. It does not crack, although I will recommend you to set it with translucent powder or compact powder but still if you are not just setting it it will stay intact also you can use it as your foundation if you are really willing to because Swiss beauty foundation honestly sucks so i'm just recommending you a concealer as a foundation if you are going for a very minimal makeup next i'm going to recommend you this stay quirky translucent powder now this is a very fine emollient powder it doesn't give you the feel of a bb powder or something it's a beautiful translucent powder and it serves the purpose it stays put throughout the day again it does not oxidize in any way which means it does not become yellowish all right so it's a very beautiful off-white undertone translucent powder it's not pure white translucent powder you know my best friend used it once and since then she is always saying that i love that powder i will be purchasing that uh, i have powder all over on my hand but it's a very fine powder guys it does not give you any tough time you can use it to set your whole face as well although i will suggest you to use this translucent powder just to set your under eye and go with the compact powder for the rest of your face but if you are from oily skin type family you can definitely use translucent powder all over on your face so if you are looking for an affordable long lasting non oxidizing translucent powder then stay quirky is the one to go for i was trying to find a good bronzer under affordable budget but somehow i could not find so let's move on to blush and i have with me this beautiful palladio matte blush now when it comes to matte blush and when 
when it comes to India, it's really difficult to find a matte blush in India. I don't know why. Lakme, Maybelline, everyone is coming up with shimmery blush like the NARS one. So I was just like kind of done with the shimmery blush and finally I found out this brand and I bought this around one year ago and I'm really enjoying it. I have purchased two of the different shades from this same range as well. But this one is a very beautiful matte blush. If you're looking for a particular matte blush then Palladio is a really good one to go for. They have shades for fair, medium and dusky skin tone and although it's a matte formula it's a very creamy blush as well. It does not have a lot of powder. Let me show you a swatch. I am just taking a few and it's really really pigmented as well. It's just one swipe blush as you guys can see it's hell pigmented. You don't have to build it a thousand times to get the maximum color. I have tried so many blush in my life and I think Palladio is the best among them under affordable budget. The next product that I have with me is this Lacme Highlighter. Yes, Lacme Highlighter. I don't want to lie, I found it a little bit dodgy when I actually purchased it because it's a powder, like loose highlighter, like the Kylie one. And after that, I was like, how to use this? They have the sponge. You cannot really apply it in a proper position, you know, you just have to go like this or this. Sometimes I just found it really really difficult back in the day but when i was used to it i could not go back to other highlighters smell of it is beautiful as well which is something that is really unique because highlighters mostly don't have any fragrance it's a chunky highlighter it's a beaming highlighter it's not a soft highlighter of course even if you are going for wet and wild or something this is much cheaper but at this budget you won't find any loose highlighter additionally this is a loose highlighter it's great when it comes to affordable makeup we have to include an eyeshadow palette and i'm talking about this hillary roda eyeshadow palette it has two variants this one is the colorful one they also have the neutral one which has a lot of browns and mid tone mauves and all of that that is really really beautiful as well i will give the link of that one in the description box you can check that but both of these are beautiful the color payoff and everything is just top notch this can beat any other expensive palette like beach cosmetics or beauty Bay palettes and all of that i just love the payoff of this palette although the shimmers has little bit of fallout that i have to mention but other than that i just love how this colors just looks it does not make any patch whenever you are blending it it just blends seamlessly the mattes doesn't have any kickback or any fallout you are getting this palette under 200 rupees and the colors are to die for what else you want the next one has to be a kajal i'm a kajal freak i have kajal on my waterline sometimes i just escape kajal because kajal is really difficult to remove when you are applying makeup in a regular basis and i am filming these days regularly so it's a hassle to remove the kajal you know back in the day when i used to go to college always i used to put on kajal no matter what it's the cosmic kajal i have talked about this thousand times on my channel you must be getting bored after hearing this for thousand times as well but trust me it's a very beautiful kajal it does not crack on the waterline although you must be thinking that she has put on this kajal and it has smudged but i have smudged the kajal by brush it has jojoba oil aloe vera vitamin e all those goodness so it's good for your waterline as well i will suggest you try to grab this from stores rather than going to online because when you are purchasing this from big bazaar or any ts cosmetic store this will come with buy two get one or 50 percent discount all of that beautiful offers which you cannot probably find in any e-commerce platform i forgot to mention in the intro but we have some accessories as well and i'm talking about swiss beauty lashes now it retails for 99 rupees and the quality is unfreaking believable it has right amount of curve it has right amount of ages it has right amount of lashes and it comes in different variants as well and the designs are really beautiful you can find out the normal to dramatic lashes under this range if you are looking for for first free beautiful affordable lashes then obviously swiss beauty is the one to go for also i have given in-depth review of all the lashes i will link it up in the eye you can go ahead and check that one out as well i wanted to keep some mascara but i could not because i have tried so many affordable mascara like sugar one swiss beauty one wet and wild one and i didn't like any of them in this video i wanted to include all the affordable products which actually worth your every single penny and trust me 
I can show you mascara by using it for three times and I can tell you that go ahead it gives you length and volume it does not clumps your lashes and all of that I can do that I'm not gonna do that I want a mascara which actually can be a one stroke mascara if I'm coating my lashes once it will be done that is not happening with the mascara that I own or the mascara that I have tried that's why mascara is skippable in this video but the last product that I have with me is lipsticks and not just any lipstick I'm talking about Nykaa mini bullet lipsticks this one is the mini one and this is creamy it's matte and it's beautiful so comfortable on the lips I really like the formulation of Nykaa bullet lipsticks I have tried so many ranges from the Nykaa but I fell in love with the quality the pricing and the color ranges of this particular variant they are just one stroke lipstick let me swatch it for you guys I'm gonna go with one swatch only and here we go I'm in the shade Naughty Nude. Overall, so inexpensive, so beautiful. And yes, with that, we have come to an end of this video. I have recommended you 10 products. I can easily suggest you some Mars products or any other products. But trust me, freshly applied makeup always looks good on the skin. I can easily show you a Mars Cosmetics one brand tutorial which look flawless but i won't do that because i know whenever i will go outside when i will face the sun when i will get sweaty all the makeups would crack and i am telling this from an experience i am here to show you a foundation which is a foundation and which serves the purpose according to its budget so yeah i hope that made sense and you enjoyed this video and you have got a little bit of idea what to purchase if you have small money and yeah that's it for this video i really hope you guys enjoyed it and if you you did then don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel it's free and also hit the bell icon so whenever i will post new new videos in future you will get a notification of that and hopefully i will see you guys on the next one till then i love you all so much stay happy stay beautiful take care bye